just don't get it. Well, maybe you should consider it ungettable. Have you been following the Special Olympics in Rio? Wait a minute, I thought the Special Olympics was for challenged athletes. Exactly. With all the pollution down there, they've had to create a bunch uh. of challenging new events. Oh, like what, pray tell? Well, there's the Salmonella shite put, <laughs> high diphtheria diving, yeah. the retching relay, and okay. the open latrine long jump. All right, I'm hooked. <laughs> I'm fascinated by the uh, cholera canoeing <laughs> and the water polio, uh, freestyle malaria, and the hop skip and a puke. <laughs> All right, how about the uh, guinea worm writhing on the floor exercise? Oh, yes. Yeah. I, you know, I prefer the trichinosis triathlon. Long? <laughs> because of the toxic garbage floating dead dogs and body parts, they've had to radically revise the sailing competitions. Yeah, I'm guessing a clean sweep would be out of the question. Then, huh? Yes. And worse, due to the Zika virus, the girl from Ipanema is eponemic, and she has a hazmat suit covering her bikini. And when she passes, each one she passes goes, Ow! Jeez! Oh! Gosh! <laughs> Give me some deet! Uh, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. The summer games are in their winter, so mosquitoes really shouldn't be a problem, should they? Yeah, well, I got a problem. What's that? Did you ever get frozen shoulder? Oh, yeah, we got one in the freezer right now. We're going to have it this weekend. Yeah, no, I'm talking about the medical condition, man. I had it bad a month ago. I couldn't even reach up to wash my hair. Wear a hat. It works for me. The most painful part is reaching back to pull out my wallet. Man. Well, that happens to me every time I go out to dinner with my money manager. <laughs> <laughs> you can imagine how I have to tend to my personal hygiene after sitting on the throne. Huh? I'd rather not. Uh, well, what did you do? Drop and roll? No, I just dragged my butt across the carpet like our dog. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's time to drag our butts out of here because here oh, comes the bus. Golly. Could, could you reach into my pants and pull out my bus pass, please? Let the driver do it. He doesn't know you. Okay, good point. Yeah. Boomers on the Bench is based on actual and factual freshly broken news. It's all re re real, folks. <laughs>